Okay, so let's solve this problem. So how many ways can 5 girls and 5 boys be seated at a round table if no restrictions? Since there's no restrictions, so n is equal to 5 girls plus 5 boys, that's 10. Since this one is a circular permutation, so using this formula, the n minus 1 factorial, but n is equal to 10, so 10 minus 1 factorial, that's equal to 9 factorial, and this 9 factorial is equal to 9 factorial, that's 362,880. So there are 362,880 ways. Then for this problem, so they need to occupy the alternate seats. So this is the placement and one seat is permanent. So let's assume that the permanent seat is for the boys. So formula now for the boys, that's 5 minus 1 factorial, that's equal to 4 factorial. And this 4 factorial is equal to 24. Then for the girls, that's 5 factorial. That's equal to 120. But if we put this permanent seat to the girls, so girls now formula is 5 minus 1 factorial. And for the boys, that's 5 factorial. Then to solve for this problem, so just multiply these two numbers. So 24 times 120, so 24 times 120, it's 2,880. So therefore, there are 2,880 ways. Then for this given, so three particular boys must sit together. So we have these five girls and five boys but three particular boys must sit together so therefore we only have one two three four five six seven eight in a round table so the equation now is eight minus one factorial but since we can arrange these three particular boys so you can have b3 first or B4 first, or the B5 first. So this one is 3 factorial. Then using the fundamental counting principles, so times 3 factorial. So this 8 minus 1 factorial, that's 7 factorial, times 3 factorial. So this 7 factorial, times 3 factorial, that's 30,240. So there are 30,240 ways. Then for this problem, so all boys must sit together. So we have these 5 girls and all boys together. So therefore, for we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 in a round table. So 6 minus 1 factorial. But since we can rearrange these 5 boys, so this one is 5 factorial. So times 5 factorial. So this 6 minus 1 factorial, that's 5 factorial times 5 factorial so we have now 5 uh, factorial times 5 factorial that's 14,400 so there are 14,400 ways